Yes, hello. I'm going to shoot a short video on uh, these OBD2 scanners. Just a little tool. They all, some look like this, some look a little different. Basically, you have to locate your plug, which is going to be the, I guess that's a male plug, so you're going to be looking for the female version of that. And they're going to be up underneath your dashboard. In my case, it's right here. You plug it in, and you see a light come on. You'll also need to download an app. On my phone, it's this one, Piston, just like it sounds. Okay, and you got to click the car button, car icon, to make it connect. Uh, Bluetooth permission, yep. Turning Bluetooth on, and hopefully this thing connects. Oh yeah, well, I don't know. Yeah, there's there's a little bit of light play down there, so that's good. When those lights start to playing, that that means it's at least shake hand shaking, and it can take a minute. Don't be impatient. You know, it's just going through the handshake process right now. They're basically recognizing each other's presence and establishing. I'm supposing a well, they say it's establishing a connection, but I believe it's actually determining protocol and that type of thing. Now if the light stops blinking you can look at the uh, hourglass thing. It's not really an hourglass, whatever that thing is called. Oh, whatever. The doohickey. You know. And it always takes the longest when I'm trying to shoot a video. It just always does. Then it doesn't want to connect to. Almost always. You know. And uh, basically when... Oh my gosh. Maybe I'm supposed to start the vehicle. I don't see why that would make a difference, you know. I honestly do not. Oh, maybe it does. Yeah, I think it's connected now. I don't know for sure, but the little thing stopped, so I'm going to push the live button. Yeah, and that gives me the, the green light for connection. Then you got to push live data. Okay, and that'll give me like, it takes it a minute. Oh, i got to push the uh, the play button here. Yeah, that gives me battery voltage. I don't know what the calculated engine means, percent. Oh, I think that's the, yeah. yeah, I think that's power or something. Engine coolant in degrees Celsius. Fuel trim stuff. I don't really understand a lot of this stuff. It gives me the RPMs, that's nice. You know, the speed, that's kind of cool. You could, uh, calibrate your speedometer although I'm not sure if that really is what that does I mean obviously if the speedometer <laughs> is off then maybe this here is off too it might help you isolate a problem ignition timing intake air temperature MAF airflow rate all that that's just for all this is for troubleshooting purposes really and it gives you your oxygen sensors run time, fuel level input, whatever that means, distance traveled. That's since I last reset it, I think catalyst temperatures. You know, it's, it's pretty neat. Now, I, I really, you know, and then you push the live button again, I really want it to fault, because I'm so fortunate my check engine light is on. So we're gonna look up the faults here, the error codes, and I already know what it's gonna give me, I think. If nothing else, this tool will help you clear the codes, but they will come back up. Huh. Looks like the darn thing. Uh... Oh, once you go to faults, it's always something else. You gotta push this little button. It's like a refresh or something. P0420. Okay. Yeah, you could look that up. I, I know what the problem is. 
and uh, I think that's all it's going to do. Yeah. So that's basically the way it works, you know. It gives you your faults, and if I wanted to, huh. I know there's a way to clear them as well. It says I have two faults. Okay. Oh, I can hit the trash can, and that should clear the codes. Now, I'm going to go ahead and do it. Uh, you should delete codes only if all problems have been fixed. Yeah, but I hit the clear button, and it turns off your check engine light. Now, I did not fix this problem, so uh, it's going to come back up. Okay, but that's just to show you how this system works. Thank you for watching.